So, Jen Bang, I thought I'd show with you what I've been doing for audio. I have a series of devices here. This is my my Behringer USB interface. It's a simple bridge. Has in and out, although I'm only using the in. A patch cable with the appropriate ends on it. I have a Behringer C2 microphone. A little bright, but it works. The usual XLR cables. This is a phantom powered mic, so it's very sensitive. I have a 1202 mixer board. Plug this in. Flows nice and blue. Microphone into channel one. Preamp about halfway. And about halfway. Main gain just under zero dB. Well, it's about zero. Take the uh, main out ports, get the right and left here. I love those big chunky plugs. And our little inputs get here, right and left. And as you saw, this has its light on, so its USB is connected. And then I will flip the audio device in my flash settings here. There we go. And now you hear me on the C2. It, uh, I can demonstrate a little bit of amplification by tweaking that up and it goes louder, tweaking it down and it goes softer. So you can tell that's working. The uh, there's the pan right and left. Do 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 pan over here, pan over there. So that should be working as planned. Then we have. Ah, oh, I wanted to show you the Sennheiser while I was at it. I'll flip it over to that one. Setting. A lot less background noises, just plain old dynamic. There you have it. So that shows how I get my audio to hook up without a lot of hum, although it certainly is noise. How do you get rid of that, or are you? Uh, extra quiet on your hardware.